Okay, we're going to set up a new um, uh, automation to trigger our smart home monitor. I used to use routines for that. Now I'll use an automation. So hit the plus sign and the new automation. So I'm going to set up an automation for something I want to have happen when we both leave. So I'm going to add a condition, member location, so when both me and my wife leave. Now, if, if present sensing has not been set up under the new app yet, it'll prompt you for this. So here I've set it up for both me and my wife. This other one that's on here, just Tom, that's the old one. Um, and I'm going to need to come back and delete that later so it doesn't get confused. But that's the legacy present sensing. The other two are the new ones. So I've got that. And I want to save this. And I don't want everybody to be at home. I want when everybody leaves. No one is at home. Okay. So when uh, I screwed that up again. When no one is at home. I'll save it. So when no one is at home, everybody leaves. And I'm going to add a condition. So only when the mode is night or home. That way, if I've got the guest mode on, it won't trigger any of these things. So I've got that set, and now I'm going to add some actions. I think the first thing I will do is change the locations mode to away, and then I'm going to set the security mode to armed away, and then I'm going to control a couple devices. I think what I'll do is take the garage door, just in case I leave it open, I will Tell it I want it closed. Hit save. So it'll close it if I've left it open. I'm going to take a look at maybe my front door lock. Oops, I think it's maybe up here. Okay, Schlage front lock. Save it, and I want that to be locked. So those are the things I want to be done. I'm going to hit Done. I'll give it a name. I want to think I'll call this um, We Armed. May change that later, but you get the idea. So that's what it looks like. And now I'll set up one for when we both come home. And I'll set up a nighttime one. And I'll set up a good morning one. And then I'm going to set up two scenes uh, that I can trigger manually for guest mode. Um, one, if guests are here, I don't want any of the security stuff going on and off as they go in and out of the house. And one if guests are gone and just sets everything back to normal. So that's it.